Tell me a secret. Good boy. Tell me a secret is a very simple trick. You're just going to be luring, like 90% of what I teach you guys, luring. So I just start off by cupping my hand and taking a treat and kind of guiding him to put his face behind my hand and just rewarding him for that motion. Yes. So just anytime he puts his face behind my hand, yes, and stays there for a second, I reward him. I hold off on rewards until he holds it for a few seconds. So I would wait and then I would reward him. So for two seconds, five seconds, I would just kind of wait with the treat in my hand to make him stay there. And then I would reward him so that he knows to hold it for a longer period of time. Once your dog's getting the motion of putting their head behind your cupped hand as you want them to, you can start by doing it with your hand near you. So even if it's not right up to your face, <laughs> yes, I know, you could just near you, put your hand up and teach him how to, yes, put his face behind your hand and start just luring it closer to you. Yes, and just reward him. You could also put your hand up to your ear and take the tree on the other side of your hand and kind of guide them to put their face up like that. Whatever works best for your dog. Sirius learned better with me teaching with my hand first and then up to my ear, but I worked with Salem doing the opposite by putting my hand up to my ear and using a treat on the other side and just rewarding him for holding his position there. So if you do want to teach it this way, you would just have your dog sit right next to you. You would take your hand near your head and take a treat on the opposite side and hold it there. Let your dog sniff it, but don't give it to them until they hold for a few seconds. And then you would start to incorporate the verbal command. I use tell me a secret. Um, you could always just say secret or whatever you're wanting to use for this verbal command. Just get creative with it. I've had people be like, you should use spill the tea or gossip or something like that. So it's up to you what you want to use. I just wanted to use tell me a secret. Tell me a secret. Good job. So again, you could teach your dog by just going behind your hand like this and rewarding them or have them sit right next to you, put your hand up to your ear and a treat and hold it there. Hold off on rewarding them until they hold it for a few seconds. They might drool on you. They might lick your hand a bunch. Just don't reward them until they stay still in that spot right next to you for a few seconds. Yes. Good job. Tummy secret? Yes. And just have treats ready in your other hand or a toy, whatever motivates your dog, and use that to your advantage. Tummy secret? Tell me a secret? Yes. And the more you work with them, the longer you can make this, like uh, them hold it for a longer period of time. So I started off by just having him hold it for two seconds and then we worked up to like five seconds. Uh, he can do like 10 seconds if I really want him to, but I kind of just keep it to like a short minimum fun trick. Yep, thanks. And after luring for a few days and incorporating that verbal command, your dog should get it. This is a very one, two step trick. It's not something that should take a long period of time. So have fun with it. Make sure your dog's having fun with it. And then your dog will know how to tell you secrets. Tell me a secret. Good job. Thank you. Good boy.